Hey, what's up guys? James Vegas Fooders here, and we're gonna do the Quick Trip three-course meal. We're gonna pick up our boy Matt, and here's my boy Tilly, my boy Riley, and then we're gonna go to Quick Trip, and we're gonna try out a full dinner for kings. We're gonna get an appetizer, an entree, a dessert, and then I'm gonna chug down some Quick Aid. It's gonna be one for the big boys. Let's go, Fooders, roll out. Hi, so we're gonna start off our Quick Trip three course meal with our drink. Now, I got Quick Trip's off brand Gatorade, Quick Aid. Now, it's a lemon lime flavor, and um, judging by the nutrition's on the back, kind of looks like flavored water if you ask me. But, um, so let's pop the lid open. It's got the classic orange Gatorade lid. I'm gonna take a little sniff of it. it smells like lemon lime Gatorade, and notice a little dent on the side. I think that's pretty bad on Quick Trip's part. I mean, like, what, what if a bug got in there? And so, here it goes. My eyes are watering. I think lemon lime's a bit misleading. I think it's like 80% lemon, 20% lime. Uh, it's really sour. For like a drink that you'd give your kid after a soccer game, I mean, your kid's gonna be crying, whether or not he won or lost, so... um. I mean, I could still drink this. I mean, like, I could chug this if I really wanted to. I guess I'd give it, like, a 7.5 out of 10. Will you chug it? You want me to chug it? <laughs> All right, I'll try to chug this, boys. My first meal of the night. <laughs> Whew. So, uh, I got past a big bulb at the top, which is classic <laughs> Gatorade bottles, but I'll pass it off to which one of you... To Matt, who has appetizers. See, we have a nice, wonderful chicken tenders here with some lovely barbecue sauce. Ooh. Let's, let's see how it goes. Make sure you dip them in right real good. A little more than that, buddy. Yeah, bend it. Hmm. The chicken tenders aren't bad. Barbecue sauce is very sweet. I don't know. I don't know how much I like it. Hmm. I can't. I can't put my. I can't put the words we'll, to we'll it. We'll try chicken tender without the barbecue sauce. Mm. <clears throat> very good. It's impossible to fuck up a chicken tender. Whoa, whoa, no swearing. <laughs> We're gonna have to bleep that. We're a Christian yeah. channel. Here. Yeah, this is a Christian YouTube channel. Come on, Matt. Children watch. We're this. gonna have to cut this whole scene. Oh <laughs> no. It's very hard to mess up a chicken tender. <laughs> now I'd like to hand it off to my. What are you gonna fellow. grade it though? What? Yeah, you gotta give it its rating first, dude. Seven out of ten. Ooh! Ooh. Actually, Ooh. Oh, there's no way it's worse actually, than wait quick a second. Wait a second. Wait a second. It's nine out of ten without the barbecue sauce. Eight out of ten with the barbecue sauce. Ooh, ooh, uh, understandable. Now we pass it on to Tilly, my fellow blogger. All what? right. So for the main entree, we've got a beautiful. A oh, perfectly cooked Angus cheeseburger on an artisan bun. Ooh, fancy. Now, if you take the bun off, <laughs> ooh, that cheese. Looks is a, it looks a little disturbing. Slightly melted. Slightly McDonald's quality. Yet also slightly curdled. Ooh, might be a bit sour. Could be similar to McDonald's quality cheese, but we'll just have to find out for ourselves. You got any sauce on that? Not at all. Going in raw. You know, it's pretty good. A little salty and a little dry, but I think adding some ketchup could fix the dry problem. When I ate it, when it was good, uh, ketchup was added to it. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. What's your final grade on it, Till? You know, I think I need to try it with ketchup before mm. I can give it a final grade. Because if the ketchup can save this, this could be really good. Mm -hmm. This could earn a 10 out of 10. Now, ketchup is actually surprisingly uh, sugary. It's very, very sweet. I mean, like, half of a ketchup bottle is just straight-up sugar. So, um, 
should definitely fix your problems you're having. Mm -hmm. Did the cheese affect it at all? It, it looked kind of curdled. A little bit, but it wasn't that bad, actually. Mm. Mm. All right, here we go. Mm. Wow. It's impressive how how much ketchup really can help a burger get to its full potential. What do you compare it to Culver's? To Culver's? It's honestly thicker than Culver's, which I really do like. Mm -hmm. is, it, is it equal to Culver's, or is it better or less? I would say it's on par with Culver's, but better and worse in its own ways. Mm. Ooh, that's surprising mm. from a gas station. I mean, like, oh, Quick, yeah. Quick Trip's, you know, main product is just gas. I mean, like, <laughs> they, they don't sell these drinks or these appetizer entrees or these desserts for, you know, profit. They just sell them for people who are on a long road. Exactly. Want a quick little meal. Great example of how it's only a gas station is their crappy, crappy Quick Aid. <sighs> I think they might have actually just taken a Gatorade bottle and slapped a Quickie label on it. I like. I mean, slightly it different. It has color. to be. Slightly the, different. Color. And then there's the orange cap too. Yeah. All right, Till. What do you give your uh, Quick Trip burger? Honestly, I give this one a solid big Tilly. Ooh. Oof. Ooh. Ooh. That's. We don't see that very often. Oh, that's a first. Mm. That's a that's a James Vegas Fooders first. So we're gonna have to pass it off to our dessert man, our cameraman, Riley. Oh, you know, here today we have the uh, limited edition Sour Patch Kids Extreme. You know, I think these are gonna be great. I love Sour Patch Kids. Uh, even sour. Let's let's bust them open, shall we? If we can get them open. Ooh, ooh, nice rip. Ooh, perfect. See, look at the different coloration. Mm. Oh yeah, that's premium quality. Means they're extra sour. Mmm, perfect. Ooh. How do you describe it? The, the ambiance is just ooh, mwah. Now, oh. if you were coming off that Tilly burger. Would you appreciate the sourness? Oh yes. Just gives me a from the sweet burger, it just gives me a nice kick of sour. Just extra added kick. What is the what is the difference do you think between regular sour patch kids and sour patch kids extreme? The flavor. I mean, it's probably basically tastes like quick aid. The sourness, but you know, stuffed into little bite-sized candies. Incredible, incredible. Oh. I love it. All right. This has been a uh, quick trip, three-course meal with Saul, Matt, John, and Riley. Whoa, did you give it a final review? Oh, oh. My, my bad. I give this a 10 out of 10. It's per they're perfect. Whoa. Oh, my they're God. Perfect. That's oh, my God. Coming off a till out of till and then a oh. 9. 9 to 8 and then a 7.5. It's oh. pretty good, everyone. Thank you. Thanks for joining us. Uh, we'll see you next time when we... Uh, review uh, Pontiac McDonald's. Ooh, Ooh. Let's see if they can get the grilled cheese right this time. <laughs> oh, yes, sir. Ooh. So, we'll see you next time, YouTube. Stay tuned. 608, we are out of here. Whoa, didn't see you there. <laughs> Listen, if you like this video, be sure to like, share, subscribe, tweet about it, and tell your friends about James Vegas Fooders. Thank you so much. Have a great day.